how to send crypto from KuCoin to MetaMask. Hey guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, we're going to see how we can send our cryptos, our tokens, from KuCoin to our MetaMask wallet. So first of all, we need to have our MetaMask uh, as an extension in our browser. If you don't have a MetaMask extension, you just need to click into MetaMask within Google Chrome or your favorite browser and you hit into download now and then you select the browser that you're currently using and then after you install it you just need to import your wallet which is pretty easy now after you've done that you need to sign into KuCoin once you are into KuCoin you want to select your wallet which is in here and we have a balance so we have to select the one that says main account and now we are into the assets overview so what you want to do is to withdraw because we want to send from KuCoin into our MetaMask wallet. So let's go ahead and select Retro. And then you have to select the coin that you want to be sending into your MetaMask. So uh, whether that would be Bitcoin, Tether, Ethereum, uh, whatever you choose. In this case, I'm going to select USDT so you can see what happens next. And then we need to fill this information. Just in order to fill this information, we need to go back into our MetaMask wallet. And we want to select the network that in this case is going to be Ethereum. If you want to use another network, you can do that. But in this case, I'm going to use Ethereum mainnet. And then we want to locate the token that we want to receive. So if you don't see the token, you can click where it says import token, and then you can look for it. Maybe you want to select AVAX. Uh, maybe you want to look for Solana. Maybe you want to look for uh, XRP. In this case, you want to look for the Tether. In this case, my USDT is already in here, so I'm going to select this one. And I'm going to copy this um, into my clipboard, and I'm going to paste it right in here. Now, once I paste this, I want to use a network called Ethereum, as you can see right here. Now, it's really important, guys, that you have to use the same wallet and the same network you're using. Otherwise, your money would be a little bit lost. Okay, so then you have to tap the amount you want to send into your wallet let's say two and then you just hit into confirm now as you can see there's a fee that costs 35 usdt it's a little high higher so i strongly recommend that you use the smart chain within the within the metamask wallet because it's a little bit more uh cheaper than others so after you hit into confirm you're going to receive a notification that it's been done. Sometimes it takes a little bit more, depends on the network that you're going to be using. And now that you are into your MetaMask, what you want to do is to focus on the token that you received. And if you select the token, you're going to see the information that was sent into your MetaMask wallet. So as you can see, this is the status confirmed, the copy transaction from what wallet to what wallet, uh, the amount and all that, right? So you're going to see it right here and you're going to see a confirmation in your email as well so just don't forget to use exactly the same network and the same address of your wallet so you don't lose your money guys so there you have it let me know if you have any question don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this app thank you for watching the video and i'll be seeing you guys on the next one